All right, well, I'm presently a professor at NYU. Um, so I'm in the uh, Tandon School of Engineering. Um, we have within that uh, engineering school, a department that's called Finance and Risk Engineering, and I'm the department chair. So I've been department chair for four years. So before that, I spent 20 years uh, in the financial industry, uh, all in New York. So I worked at uh, three different places. Um, so started at Morgan Stanley in 96, um, went to Bank of America around the year 2000, went to Bloomberg after that, and went back to Morgan Stanley. So did a round trip in 2010, <laughs> and then left for NYU around 2000, early 2016. So, um, so um, before I went to the um, went to Wall Street, I was a professor at Cornell University in upstate New York in Ithaca. Uh, for eight years, and um, for that, a PhD from UCLA, um, and for that, um, an MBA and a Bachelor of Commerce degree from University of Toronto. And we won't go back to high school <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so were you, are you originally from Canada, and then you decided yes. to move to the U.S.? Yeah, that's right. I'm Canadian, um, although I'm also a U.S. citizen right now. Um, so um, I left uh, Toronto uh, after an MBA in 83. And uh, went to UCLA. Um, so when I was thinking about doing a finance PhD, um, I really I only applied to um, three schools, all in uh, California, because I was tired of Toronto weather, basically. And uh, you know I had a pretty good uh, GMAT score, so I knew I'd get into at least one. And um, yeah, I got into UCLA and Berkeley, and um, and um, I, my I conferred with a professor at U of T who thought UCLA would be a good choice. So that's where I went. And um, so, um, so once I was in the US, I realized it's, uh, it's quite, a, you know, quite an amazing country. I still think so. Uh, I think you'll find most immigrants like me love the US even more than uh, people born here, you know? Yeah. So, um, so I had no reason to leave and I didn't. So I, uh, I stayed after that and, um, after, um, I mean, so I, um, after September 11th, actually, I thought uh, maybe things would change with the open border between Canada and the US, actually. I mean, terrorists were actually crossing from the Canadian border. So I um, applied for US citizenship and got it shortly afterwards. 